We're, We're back. back. It's Welcome Wednesday. My favorite. I'm Casey. This is Hannah. No football today. He's uh, he's hard at work right now. Stick we also, a rest. We also got uh, Justin's not here. He's in a bunch of meetings making sure that Legends Fields is going to be the best it's ever been. Um, with that being said, everything's close to sell. Yeah. I know, man. It's like kind of depressing because like there's all these teams that want in and we're running out of space. So make sure you get in. We have openings in the uh, opening day challenge. Yep. Uh, we have openings in the Rising Stars. Yep. The Firecracker, one of my favorite events. Fireworks, Fourth of July weekend. Absolutely. Fireworks at Legends are just great. Uh, fireworks or Firecracker Classic and New York State Travel Ball Championship. Oh, Two spots, two or three spots left in Empire, yeah. and then the New York State Travel Ball Championships uh, the week after. That's it. That's, that's all we have spots for. That's sad. <laughs> it's sad, but we have a so, lot of teams uh, Oh, and in. softball, I think I have, or we have, as a group, two spots left in Champions Nationals. I think two or three. Uh, the couple new registrations came in. We'll read those off and talk about those. Uh, make sure that you head over to championsevents.com. Um, to register. Yep. Make sure that you email Hannah at championsevents.org or give us a call at 315-430-0154. Well, we're here. We'll answer the calls. Hannah answered a couple today. Yeah. I answered some yesterday. So, I mean, there was it's always answering. We're tag answering. teaming it. Where's that? <laughs> um, with that being said, it's Welcome Wednesday. We got a good list here. A lot of new teams that we haven't read off and uh -huh. some ones traveling from far, far away. Um, to start off, Rising Stars, Hannah, what do we got for a softball? We have the Cayuga Lady Bombers, Eric Johnson, uh, and then the Gettys Thunderstick. Gettys Thunderstick. So they're yeah. local here. Never heard uh, of them, Case. They're out of uh, Gettys. They have uh, came around a couple years ago. Uh, they're pretty good. They have some. They have a very good team that uh, I can't wait to see at the Rising Stars event. Awesome. Uh, Legend Summer Classic, we have a couple softball teams that registered. Uh, Edge Softball is joining us there, and then the CNY Avalanche, which I think came in yesterday. Uh, two uh, days, two ago. days ago. Yeah. Uh, that's Coach Garrett over there. Uh, Garrett does a great job with the Avalanche. Great logo, by the way. Um, and that can that was the that was the cap on the Legend Summer Classic. For softball. Uh, baseball wise, we have the Fairport Red Rage, uh, Geneva Elite. Um, also coming to the Legend Summer Classic, Geneva Elite, uh, great organization, Coach Angel Lopez, great guy. Uh, I met him through uh, another realm, and he was like, yo, my son plays, we've got a team. I said, you got to come up to Historic Legends Fields, and now he is, and it's going to be a blast. Um, then we got the Firecracker, Firecracker Classic. Um, we got the WNY Prospects and CB Futures. And then CB also the Camillus Wildcats. Oh, I see that. Yeah. Camillus, look at that. Uh, Local. Uh, so Another good uh, group there for the Firecracker. And then here's a big list. One of Hannah's favorites events. I love this I think event. it's everyone's favorite event. It's the best on the East Coast. It's the only softball event you should be playing in in the month of July if you're on the East Coast. Even if you're on the West Coast, fly in. Yeah. I mean, why not? So coming to that one, we have the Kugel Lady Bombers. Yep. We have the PA Outlaws. They're bringing two more teams. That's like three or four teams four, that they're total, bringing. Yep. We've got the Red Storm, your alum. My alum. They're coming in representing. Uh, we have the East Coast Titans. I mentioned this yesterday on Top Play Tuesday. The East Coast Titans, Coach Sean, all the way from Salisbury, Maryland, um, out there on the island. He's, he's getting his group together, um, and they're coming up. And they also, not to like go on a tangent, but... They also got evaluated, so we know that their metrics are top notch, which is going to make their play better because they went and got uh, got metric tested by Top Owner Sports. Visit topownersports.com. Best player development system out there. Absolutely. Check it out. We also have joining us, last but not least, just just registered. Who do we got? <laughs> the Misfits. <laughs> the NNY Misfits. Coach Alicia. I was hounding her, texting her, texting her. I said, what's, what's Nationals without the NNY Misfits? They've been for about eight or nine years. They've been playing in, in Nationals. So she's back. She's bringing her 18U team to that. Empire State Classic? Yeah, what do we, we got? We have the here? Seneca All Stars. Uh, Geneva Elite is coming back. Coming back to Legends Fields <laughs> just because they love it up there so much. Um, we have the Accelerate Elite Baseball. Accelerate Elite. So these guys are new. They kind of merge with another team up in the Utica area. Uh, they actually actually have uh, the Accelerate facility, which is a large indoor complex. Very cool complex here in upstate New York. And then, go ahead, Case. You want to say the last one? Uh, it's, is it Colossal Baseball? I think so. They must be huge. I mean, <laughs> oh, wait, not the last one because we can't oh. forget. 
Diamond Pro. Pro. Coach Tony, <laughs> he's like, I've given you 15 teams. Take a 16th. Yeah. We're coming to the Empire State Classic. Um, also coming back to New York State Tribal, Accelerate Elite. And we can't forget, uh, these guys had to move from um, Stars, Stars and Strikes Stars. because of conflict. They were in another tournament back home they forgot about. So they're jumping They're jumping into the Harbor Fest Summer Classic with five teams, and that's the Bam Savages. Yeah. And we love Jen and Bob. They come up. They have, they're great to be around. They're fun to watch the boys play. Um, and that was a great list. That's a lot of teams, Case. I mean, the list is going to keep getting smaller because we have limited spots available. We are, like I said before, we were almost sold out. Hannah's taking calls every day, emails. We're going through, we're sifting through, figuring out what spots we have. We're trying to make room for everybody. Um, I know this Hotels year. are slim, man. I know. Very slim. We've been working with Sarah Sports Travel uh, as best as we can to get uh, everyone a spot. Um, also, new this year, we've got tarps. Um, I know we've, we, there was something big last year yeah. with the weather that we had. And come on, we live in upstate New York. You never know what's going to happen. You look outside and you got <laughs> snow, rain, sleet, hail. You never know what's going to happen. Maybe a tornado will blow through. <laughs> but we've got tarps, so the dirt's not going anywhere. Um, it'll, it'll be able to keep the water off the field this year. We'll be able to play longer. Um, so that's something cool coming to Legends Fields. Also, like Justin always says, always new menu items. I've actually locked in a couple of our great acts on stage. Um, I've been working with uh, Steve McQueen, uh, Cam Caruso, and working out a couple more. Uh, those guys are actually up for a Sammy Award, so they're battling out in round four right now. So it's really cool to see those guys. They've already committed. They're coming back. Awesome. Those dates and that lineup of our Fan Fest concert series will be released, and we love it up there. It's historic a vibe. It's, it's a great such a vibe. vibe. It's fun. It is fun. And with that being said, I'm Hannah, and this is Casey, and we'll see you next Wednesday.